Take it a short Wild West vacation. My friend and I decided to win a rodeo. We hope to win and donate the prize money to the old cowboy's rock and retirement home until that nosy dinosaur and his pesky friend showed up and started to cause a big trouble. Wait a minute. That's like a totally uncool and mondo wrong story. You can find out what really happened next. all together and he's not even here yeah it's strange i wonder what this big news is that he has to tell us huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh no i think we're gonna be run out of town that's precisely why i called you all together are you, like, you know, challenging us to a showdown or something? <laughs> yeah, ice cream at 30 bases. Ready? Draw! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, guys. Sit down and listen up. I got a letter from my Uncle Eli. The one who owns a ranch in Nevada? Yeah. See, he's gonna be in a big rodeo, and he needs some extra help around the ranch. Guess who he invited to stay there for a few days? Us? Isn't it great? He even sent the plane tickets. All right. I feel really bad about this, Denver, but but it'll only be for a few days. Oh. And Heather promised she'd keep you company. Oh, I can't leave you like this. I better call Jeremy and tell him I can't go. Bye. Wally? Hey, how'd you know it was me? I, I didn't even say anything. Oh. Heather said you were here. What? What's Heather doing at your house? Huh? Oh. Oh. Come on, Denver. I I'm trying to talk on the phone to Jeremy. Oh. Ah. Wally, <laughs> I'm here, not on the phone. Uh, I knew that. I think I figured out a way for Denver to go with us. How? In one of those crates they use for extra-large pets? They put them in the cargo hold on the plane. Uh, I know it's not first class, but what do you think, Denver? I think we should talk to Denver about going on a diet. I see my uncle's truck over there. Well, I'm glad you and your partners could make it, Jeremy. Uh-oh. Uh, 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 oh, yeah. Uh, 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 I hope you boys aren't allergic to hay. Oh, no. We're, we're, we're just not used to this clean air. <laughs> Come on, Denver, this way. <laughs> Will you be okay in here for a while? We'll be back to check on you later. Shades? Huh? Uh, no, no. Uh, let one of the other guys go. See, I, I, I ride all the time. You do? You didn't tell me. Do I have to tell you everything? Well, come on now, Shades. Show us what you can do. Yeah! Right. Show us what you made of. Uh, your left foot goes. 
goes in that stirrup, son. Oh, <laughs> see, I, I was getting on the Australian way. But I, I can do it the other way if you want. Okay. <laughs> Got it. No problem, amigo. You just hold on tight, son. Come on, horse, let's go. <laughs> What do you mean? No, I said let's go, vamos! Yeah! Get go! Where's the brakes on this thing? Just pull back on the reins and say, whoa! <laughs> you can get down now, partner. Huh? <laughs> Shades, my man! Where's our lemonade? What'll you do with that big cash prize if you win the rodeo, Uncle Eli? Well, there's a large parcel of land I'd like to buy to use as a wild Mustang horse sanctuary. What's a sanctuary? It's a place where the horses can live, free and safe. The only problem is, my biggest rivals in the rodeo also want the land. Build a crooked gambling casino. Gee, then the horses would have no place to go. Well, who would be sleazy enough to do a thing like that? Huh? Hey. Well, sir, looks like you're about to find out. <laughs> Oh, no. Howdy, Eli, baby. I thought you'd like to meet my uh, partner, Sloan, the man who's gonna beat you in the rodeo. <laughs> hey, don't I know you are desert rats? Yeah. But, uh, these boys are my guests, unlike some people. Yeah, well, I can take a hint. But uh, your guests and I have met before. We saw Denver's first concert together. <laughs> Yeah, but as I recall, you didn't have a good time. Well, this time I think my luck is gonna change for the better. See ya, partners. <laughs> I trust that man about as much as a starving coyote in a chicken coop. <laughs> Come on, boys, rise and shine. There's chores to be done. Oh. oh, man. I didn't even know the world was here this early in the morning. Uh, Jeremy, which end does the milk come out of? Here you go, little guy. Okay. Oh, suey. Suey. Oh. Hey, dude. <laughs> says that we can go riding since we're finished with our chores. Count me out. Come on, Shades. You didn't look too dumb on horseback. Thanks loads. Oh. Huh? Denver wants you to ride on his back. <laughs> hey, well, what are we waiting for? Look, wild Mustangs. See that big white one? That's whirlwind. Uncle Eli says he's the leader of the herd. Hey, it's Fizzback's partner, Sloan. It looks like he's heading towards the herd. I, I better go get Uncle Eli. Better get Denver out of sight. Here, <laughs> mine now. Let that horse. 
go. Whirlwind's not yours. He belongs to whoever can catch him. He belongs wild and free. And he's gonna stay that way as long as I'm around. <laughs> You're gonna regret that. But I'll wait to get my revenge at the rodeo, where everyone can see me beat you. <laughs> well, boys, we've won for now. I just hope I win that rodeo, though, for the sake of Whirlwind and the rest of the herd. I wish we could have brought Denver. I know. I feel bad leaving him at Uncle Eli's ranch. I knew that dino was here somewhere. <laughs> That's perfect. I'll just tell Sloan to pay Denver a visit while the boys are away. Somewhere. Oh, what a way to talk. I just wanted to give you greetings from Denver. <laughs> what are you talking about? Yeah, what's going on? Just that uh, Denver is going to be uh, staying with me for a while. <laughs> hey, chill out. What have you done with our dinosaur? Martin, yet. Oh, oh, what are you talking off. about? But if Sloan should lose, I got a brilliant idea for a new country western road show, Prehistoric Prairie, starring the world's only living Bronchosaurus, Dino Dude Denver. <laughs> I think I'm gonna be sick. Gee, Morty, just when we thought you couldn't get any sleazier. Well, thank you. <laughs> but uh, I think right now my partner has an announcement to make. Hey. Hey. What? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm pleased to announce that I've captured a wild Mustang whirlwind. <laughs> and plan to ride him to victory in the rodeo tomorrow. Oh, no. Not whirlwind, too. Huh? Hey, I'll <laughs> wave to you tomorrow from the winner's cycle. <laughs> <laughs> I know you boys are worried about Whirlwind. Good luck, Uncle Eli. Well, thanks, Jeremy. I'll do my level best to make you proud. How touching. Yeah, yeah. too bad he's gonna lose. Right, kitties? <laughs> yeah. We'll wait until after the competition and follow Fizz back to see where he's hiding Denver. Our contestants today will compete in three events. Bulldog, Bronco Ride, and Camp Rope. Now our first contestant today is going to be Eli Johnson. Come on, Eli. Hey, man, what are you yelling for? Well, don't we want him to win? If he does, it's bye-bye Denver. Oh. Yeah. Next up is Sloan McCall. Yay, yeah, Sloan! Now why are you cheering for him? Uh, so we can get Denver back? Oh, but he's the bad guy. I wish you'd make up your mind. Well, folks, it looks like Eli has won this round. Next is the Bronco Buster. You gotta win this last event. 
You bet I will. See, I have a feeling that a wild ball is gonna be accidentally led into the arena with Eli. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Gee, too bad for him. Uh -huh. All right, let's go. You're up next. <laughs> <laughs> Contest is gonna be close. I can't stand to watch. Wait, I think I see Denver. Huh? Where? Where? Down there, in a rodeo clown suit. That seems highly unlikely. Maybe the strain's affecting your brain. Oh, maybe you're right. And now, here's Eli Johnson. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> So fast. Denver, are you okay? Yeah. Whoa. <sighs> Whoa. Thanks to Shades, he is. <laughs> you are great. Smooth move. That was quite a bit of riding there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Uh, yeah. All in a day's work, Pilgrim. Who needs this western stuff anyway? More than Fizzbag belongs in bigger and better places. Yeah, I'll show them. I'll come back. More than Fizzbag always retains. Well, I bet old Whirlwind will be mighty glad to get back to his herd. And they'll all be safe now. <laughs> yep, this land belongs to the Mustangs. And if people like Sloan try to capture them, They'll be dealing with the law. <laughs> yeah, like Fizzback and Sloan are now, huh? They're in a heap of trouble for trying to cheat at that rodeo. There's the herd! Well, I guess it's time to say goodbye. <laughs> you know, 
I only wish I knew who that sunglass stranger was who saved my life. I sure wanted to thank him. Don't worry. Bye. I think he knows how you feel. <laughs>